Hello, my name is Matthew, and my advisor is Dr. Janra Bantang. Today I'll give a brief on our work entitled In Silico Generation of Granular Heaps Using a Cellular Automaton Model for Analyzing Heap Conductivity. So our work deals heavily with granular materials. These can be defined as a collection of solid particles that are in close contact with each other. There are many examples such as sand, pebbles, powders, cereal, and even tapioca pearls. Granular materials are known to exhibit a wide range of complex behavior and are used extensively in industry. Another major topic in our work is cellular automata. A cellular automata, or CA, is a grid where we apply simple rules simultaneously on the system and the state of the current cell is dependent on its neighbors. Here is an example of a star CA, something that can be found in Conway's Game of Life. Here we see that applying simple rules over and over again can produce complex patterns. In our work, we create a heap via CA. And this heap is then converted into a network where nodes represent the granular particles and the edges are the neighboring particles. We then assign each edge of the network a conductance value that is drawn from a probability distribution function. Once all the edges have been assigned conductance values, we compute the current in the network and obtain the effective resistance. We found that for the dynamic heap, effective resistance was found to be lower compared to the static counterpart. By introducing random potentials across the particles, upon initialization, it was initially found to be less efficient than when having zero or no initial potentials. With the introduction of learning rate sigma, we improved the convergence rate of the random potential setup without major changes in the effective resistance readings. So thank you and have a nice day.